guys, Georgia back here with another really fast, quick design, perfect for the festival season. So we're going to start off using a Meron white star bend, just to get the base down, it's really easy and you can paint straight on top of it. Next we've got some Wolf black paint and um, a number 3 local nail round brush. So we're going to start drawing the dandelion just to a simple teardrop with a, a large, you can see it, a large dot. And then we're gonna go round, I start on the edge just so the dandelion doesn't get too big to mark out where I want it to be and start to draw the seedlings. And the seedlings are gonna get smaller towards the top of the stem. So we're joining up the stem and the top of the seedlings just with some um, lines, try not to make these too thick. It's nice and light on your brush. Next we're going to draw some seedlings kind of blowing off into the wind so they're going to get smaller as they go up into the hairline. Um, yeah, just drawing the tops of the seedlings here. Um, and I think it adds interest if they're all blowing in different directions because then it gives the illusion that they're actually blowing in the wind. Once we've done that we're going to add some glitter, so just some whatever colour glitter you so desire. So you're just going to dip a slightly damp brush into a glitter pot and then just place it and with the brush wherever you feel needs a bit of sparkle. And going in with some white dots will vary in, in shapes and sizes. I've tried to do like a line here so it, it gives the illusion again of wind and blowing the seedlings away from the dandelion. Going in with some highlights, just add some contrast to that black. And with my local nail brush, I forget the name of this but I think it's the Flora Collection or something like that. It makes really good grass. I've just used a um, split cake with two different colour greens in. Um, and you can also go back and add some white highlights to this bit as well. And of course some green glitter just to finish it off. 